A new at 10 breaking in tonight. Central Private School is picking up the pieces after a burglary over the 4th of July weekend. NBC Local 33's Jonah Gilmore joins us with details on the crime that could cost the school tens of thousands of dollars. Jonah? Yeah, John, the, th the thief walked onto the campus, got into the buildings, and did a lot of damage. What he didn't think about, the cameras that caught him in the middle of the act. We don't want to lock down our campus. Our school should be a haven for our students. It should be a haven for our teachers to come anytime they want. Take a look at this video. Police say the man you see walking broke into Central Private High School, took pricey equipment, leaving them with a hefty bill. But right now it stands at about $30,000. And we're stealing computers and then decided to, to uh, take some projectors, computer projectors that were mounted onto the ceiling. And when they did, uh, instead of removing them, uh, they just tore the whole ceiling down. Police say two men, including 30-year-old Blaine Browning, broke windows to enter the buildings. From there, they piled up a stash, taking items that teachers used in their classrooms. It's everyday stuff that's used with these students, uh, preparing them for the, the next grade, the next level, for life. A lot of our teachers had uh, lesson plans and things like that stored in these computers. In several of the classrooms, you can see the ceilings are ruined. The hall where the burglary happens is lined with several hard drives, monitors, and even a megaphone. Prescott says those items were retrieved, some of them from a theft that happened back in January. We have insurance, obviously. Uh, I'm right now looking at the totals and looking at what we can salvage to see if it will be worthwhile. As they work to get everything fixed ahead of the first day of school, Prescott says if the thieves really needed something, all they had to do was ask. Taking things that don't belong to you, and especially taking things that are to educate and help out children, uh, just doesn't ring any bell with me. Now, deputies are looking for the man. They say help this guy, Browning, carrying out the theft. Anyone with information can actually call Crime Stoppers at 344-STOP. Reporter in the studio, Jonah Gilmore, NBC Local 33 News.